it's Angela Prophet, and you're tuning in to Productive and Profitable Wedding Planning on APTV. Today's tip is be flexible in vendor contracts. Here is the situation. I had a bride hire me just a couple of months before her wedding. She was super stressed out and thought that she could plan it on her own. And she had all great vendors lined up and she had a beautiful venue that I was familiar with working at, so I took the job on. Typically, we just like to do full planning so we can walk the bride through beginning to end. But I decided to take it on. We didn't have an event that weekend, so I thought it was meant to be. So we started to get into the process. I was reviewing all of our vendor contracts, and again, the stress was really getting to her. And so unfortunately, the outcome was the wedding was called off. I really didn't even get to know the groom, or I can't even remember if I got to meet the groom. But unfortunately, I got to call all of the vendors and tell them that the wedding had been called off and the stress just got to them. They were gonna push things back. And was there anything that we could do to get her money back for all the deposits? And as we know, we as vendors hold the date and we probably turn down other jobs, right? And so it's just not that easy to give your money back when we're counting on that money, right? So what we did in the vendor contracts that did not have a cancellation policy, they said, okay, if she wants to have another event or an anniversary party for her parents or something within six months, we will be happy to apply that deposit to the new event. So she was very happy with that because her parents did have something coming up. But instead of planning something for her parents, I got a call two months later and she had met someone else and wanted to move forward with a wedding, and he was the one. I never had that happen before, but I thought, okay, whatever. Apparently, she knew this guy for a long time. They had been friends, and they reconnected, and she thought, this, this is it. This is a great guy, and this was years ago, so they're still married today. They have two kids, and they're doing great, and I'm glad that they reconnected. We had a stress-free wedding, and I think that it all had to do with the groom and she wasn't with the right person to begin with and i'm so happy that she reconnected and found the right person for her so at the end of the day make sure that your vendors have some flexibility in their contracts did you like this video if you did like it subscribe and share it with your friends you can even leave me a comment and if you have a wedding planning question send it my way if you want even more great resources to create a productive and profitable wedding planning business, plus some email updates from me that I only talk about in my email, come on over to my website, angelaprofit.com, and be sure to sign up for email updates. Thank you so much for tuning in to Productive and Profitable Wedding Planning on APTV.